Hey guys, welcome back to Product Nation. And in this video, we're gonna be talking about another product launched by Xiaomi. So in this one, we're gonna be talking about the Redmi K30 and the K30 Pro. If you stick around to the end of the video, we also have a bonus product that we're gonna be throwing in with this video as well. So make sure you stick around to the end. Really quick before we begin the video, make sure that you guys are subscribed to our YouTube channel and have turned on post bell notifications for more tech updates just like this one. So the internet has been flooded with announcements about the Xiaomi Redmi K30 and K30 Pro. So we're going to talk about basic specs and a lot of leak and potential things we've heard about this phone in this video. The phone has been speculating all over the internet and is said to be the next flagship for smartphones. The Redmi is rumored to feature a 6.66 inch Full HD Plus AMOLED display with 120 hertz refresh rate. That is insane. I've mentioned this before, having an AMOLED display with 120 hertz refresh rate is very difficult because having an OLED or an AMOLED screen with higher refresh rates can get really complicated. But Xiaomi is saying that they're going to be doing that, so we're really excited to see how this goes. We also talked about the new Samsung phone having 120 hertz refresh rate with the S AMOLED, so you guys can click here to watch that video as well. As far as rumors are concerned, the display is supposed to have a punch hole cutout with a dual front camera system and also pill-shaped punch hole housing like the ones that appeared on the Samsung S10 Plus. So a lot of comparison for this phone has been made with the Samsung S10 Plus series. Instead of having an in-screen fingerprint sensor like the Samsung phone, the phone has a side-mounted fingerprint sensor included. So the K30 is also gonna support dual mode 5G connectivity and run on Snapdragon 730 or 735G on the K30. Meanwhile, the K30 Pro will probably be featuring a Snapdragon 865 processor. Now, this is the fastest processor in the market right now, and the K30 Pro version will probably be running MIUI 11 out of the box. In terms of the camera, we're still unsure on the actual specs until it's revealed, but according to some sources, we're expecting it to have Sony's latest IMX686 60 megapixel image camera sensor. One of the most interesting things in the upcoming smartphone from Xiaomi would be the 30 watt charger they're finally including in the box. So this is going to be included with with your unit rather than you having to purchase it separately. It is said to be released in 2020, but is confirmed to launch in December 2019, according to the Redmi GM. So in terms of pricing, we're still unsure on the official price. However, we do know that this is gonna be one of the most affordable 5G smartphones on the market right now. All right, so now it's time to talk about the bonus product that we were talking about. This is the Xiaomi 100 watt turbo charger. Xiaomi unveiled a 100 watt charger at the Xiaomi development conference in China a while back. Apparently they're releasing it to take on Vivo's 120 watt super flash charger, which is said to be able to charge your phone to 100% in just 13 minutes. So Xiaomi has claimed that their upcoming turbo charger can charge a phone with 4,000 milliamp hours in just the span of 17 minutes. A demonstration video was shown during the conference as well that it can charge a full battery of 4,000 milliamp hours in just 17 minutes. Phones like the Redmi Note 8, Note 7 series and the K20 series can be fully charged in under 20 minutes. This may seem super convenient to those who are always on the go and don't have enough time to charge their phones or they use their phones so much that they run out of battery and then they don't have enough time to charge it. So this is great for you guys. But at the same time, fast charging generally introduces challenges such as overheating, which also potentially shortens battery life. That's what happened to my phone. Hopefully Xiaomi is able to overcome these challenges that come with a charger that's faster than 50 watts. Xiaomi has also said that the charger comes with a high voltage charge pump bundle with nine fold charge protection. I have no idea what that means, but it sounds very good. So yeah, let's pretend like that's a very good thing. Anyway, guys, that's about it. I'm really excited about 100 watt charger. I want to be able to charge my phone very quickly. So should you guys be. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. We hope this video was informative to you. Do let us know in the comments below and the poll what you're most excited about. Is it going to be the 60 megapixel camera? Is it going to be the 100 watt fast charger? Or is it going to be 5G connectivity? Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you again in the next one.